us. Thanks for opening the oven. Oh Okay, okay, so I made a mistake. So what's wrong? So the... Oh, it's not gonna fit. Okay, put it in this. So we gonna... have a crisis mode. Welcome to the Kitchen and Jewelry Show. Welcome to the Cappies and Boobs Show. The Yeah and Boob Show. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Little Food, food Fights. Fight. What makes this little food fight even fightier is that this episode has been sponsored by ButcherBox. So yes. shout out to ButcherBox. Thank you for sponsoring this video. As we usually say on Little Food Fight. It's not that the food is little, it's that the steaks are little. People for a very long time have been saying, will you please do a little food fight where the steaks are actually what you're cooking and the steaks are tiny? And finally, we were like, what if we... Got sent steaks. Got sent steaks. And, and then we, did that video. Did, did that video. <laughs> ButcherBox provided these steaks along with a whole host of other meats. You're going to hear all about that a little bit later. A little bit later. Here's the thing about filet mignon. It is the best steak. I realize that filet mignons are for bougie babies who love their beautiful garnishes and their little salad fork and their dinner fork and everything set appropriately. Uh, and that's me. That's who I am. Yeah. As you guys may or may not have noticed, we're in a new kitchen. We're all getting used to the new space. But don't worry about it. Don't worry, it's not, don't yeah. worry about it. Don't worry about it. There's no one here. It's a pandemic. And, and that's why the camera keeps falling. That's why the camera work is bad. Yeah. That's why our have audio- Have you ever wondered why our camera work is, is bad? bad. <laughs> the person behind the camera is not qualified because they do don't not exist. exist. That house has been empty for 30 years. She's haunted, baby. <laughs> and she's loving it. <laughs> Oh. That house has been empty for 40 years, but that f hasn't. <laughs> Why are you so much funnier than I am? I'm not much funnier than you are at really? all. No. I think you are. I'm not at all. I have like, I don't know. Well, you have imposter syndrome and- I do have imposter syndrome. I have really bad imposter- Not to get real in the middle of a little food fight. Little food fight. A little sad fight. Little sad fight. <laughs> no, I'm more sad! Oh, it's a big sad fight. Big sad Big sad fight. fight. You know that. Sometimes I wonder, when will I be smarter than garlic? Little food fight! <laughs> when will, will I be smarter than garlic? garlic? It turns out never. Probably not. Part of little food fight is fighting our feelings. That's true. Little feelings fight. Little feelings fight. I feel like you're putting a lot of stuff on your steak and I'm not gonna put a lot of stuff on my steak. I'm just gonna rely on my skills to cook this steak. You know what? I am gonna take my, my new sweater off for this part. I just think maybe it's a good idea. My mom knit this sweater. <laughs> And she sent it to me and then was keeps asking me when I'm gonna debut the sweater on the channel. I know, and so she's gonna watch this video and be like, not like this! Not like this, please don't get meat juice on my sweater! My filet is covered in my rub. It's, co <laughs> it's, covered. it's covered in my rub. <laughs> my steak is seasoned with salt, pepper, chili, garlic powder, and garlic and olive oil. And what I'm gonna do is put it in a Ziploc baggie and let it marinate for about half an hour. And then when it's done marinating, then I shall... Inherit uh, the earth. Yeah, then I shall inherit the earth, but also then I'll broil it. So while we're waiting for this to marinate, we should talk about our butcher box bounty. Ooh. Oh my God, Ooh. it's our box! Butcher box? Our magic box! Ooh. This is butcher box. Butcher box ships high quality meats frozen at peak freshness in 100% recyclable and eco-friendly packaging straight to your door. That's amazing. Yes. And can we crack inside? Let's, open, let's see what's in the box. This is our applewood smoked pecan. Mm. Ooh, full of treats. Yummy. Our wild caught Alaskan sockeye salmon. From Bristol Bay to, to your, your plate. plate. <laughs> A pair of pork chops. Yummy. That's gonna be dinner. Ooh. Oh, and we also have Little fillets. We have this whole roast chicken. Oh my god, there's more. <laughs> we got these New York strip steaks. And we have ground beef. Ground beef. Look at these meats. Wow. Yeah, all these meats, all these meats plus two more two fillets. Two more fillets came in this box. When you're choosing your own butcher box, you can choose from five box options, including a custom box, and choose from over 21 different cuts of meat and seafood. We like having options. And we certainly have a lot of options, options. right now. Butcher box offers 100% grass-fed beef, free-range chicken, heritage breed pork, and wild-caught seafood. You know what's fun? Having meats come to your door, okay? You're a busy person. You like it when meats come to your door. You like it when you get a selection. We all love to eat a box. We all, listen, you know us. We love eating box. We love eating box. Why don't I make it a butcher box? <laughs> butcher box totals to less than $6 per meal and you can cancel penalty free anytime. Sounds great. 
sounds pretty good. I mean, I feel like we have all sorts of great plans for all these meats. We're yeah. gonna make burgs. We're gonna make pork dumplings because we're gonna shred them up into dumplings. We're, gonna, we're make... gonna make a whole roast chicken with some rosemary. We have like literally just a whole week's worth of yum 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 yum. By the way, Butcher Box is offering new members an amazing deal. You get two pounds of ground beef for free for the lifetime of your subscription. Plus shipping is always free. Just click the link in our description and get yourself set up. If we get back to the cooking of the steak, we'll have some fillets to eat very soon. I know, right? Early dinner. I guess we should get started. I know. All right. Mm -hmm. Crazy. Welcome to my channel. I'm gonna be cooking for you guys today. We don't have a cast iron skillet, so I'm cooking this in a Dutch oven. Um, is the stove on? No. Okay. I got a Dutch oven, I got butter in the Dutch oven, I got this fan on, catch them fumes, I got this steak with the olive oil, the olive oil and the butter, they're gonna get married, it's gonna be fine, it's gonna be like opposites attract. You're cooking the entire steak in a Dutch oven, or? Yeah, I'm cooking the entire steak in a Dutch oven. Just that? Yes, I'm cooking, yes. Okay. okay. I didn't know that was a thing people did. Yes. I'm so does it go in the in the oven oven or yes? Just... <laughs> it's gonna go in the oven. Okay, oven. well you didn't make it clear. Alright, here we go. <laughs> you made no noise at all! <laughs> all you steakheads at home might be saying, Kristen, why are you cooking this in a fing Dutch oven? To which I would say, well, because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, I've never seen anyone push around a steak. <laughs> Kristen, a woman on the edge! Pushes around a steak in a pot because she doesn't know what else to do. I guess I'll flip it now. Oh, it does look browner. Yeah. Mm. I don't know if it's gonna get crusty though, because it's not hot enough. We gotta put it in the oven now. It's gotta happen now. <laughs> it ha it's gotta happen now, Jen. Okay. She's going in the oven. Okay. Thanks for opening the oven. Oh, sh Okay, okay, so I made a mistake. So what's wrong? So the... Oh, it's not gonna fit. Okay, put it in this pan. So it's not we gonna... have a crisis mode. The Dutch oven won't fit in the oven right now. We're gonna use this pan because you need to get in the oven. Yeah, but it's not gonna fit. I don't know if that's oven safe though, is the thing. I got it, I got it, I got it. We're just gonna, we're gonna use this because I know... We're... Okay, we got it. This is oven safe. Going into the broiler, Going bye. into the broiler, bye! <laughs> okay, so what happened was... I turned on the broiler, but and I was gonna put the Dutch oven in the oven with the broiler, but the Dutch oven is too tall and nothing else is oven safe. So instead I put a cookie pan in the oven. And now we wait. And now we wait. It's crazy you don't use a timer. No, I just use my heart. My yeah. heart knows me. Oh yeah, baby. Do you need an oven yet? No, that's fine. <laughs> Just shh. <laughs> it's fine. Everyone, shut up. <laughs> I'm gonna break down in the tub later, as is my Friday tradition. Okay. Oh shit. Okay. It's over. Okay. Oh, I gotta take it out. I gotta take it out. Oven man. Oven man. Oven man. What are you doing? No. 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 Do not use it. Oh. Why is this not on? Oh, <laughs> oh f I. Hold on, I gotta turn it off. Oh god. You feel good? No. <laughs> Here's the thing though. As someone who doesn't know very much about meat, I think it's still gonna turn out really good. <laughs> Kristen just finished cooking her steak. I'm gonna cook mine. So we have the broiler set to 500 degrees. Yes. My plan is, I would say the steak is about an inch-ish, a little bit inch thick. Mm -hmm. So what I do for steaks of that length is I do three minutes on each side with an additional minute on each side if I think there needs to be extra browning. So I'm not gonna brown on the stove. We're gonna oh. pop in the pan and we're going straight into the oven. But I do need a timer. Steak in the pan. Yeah. Going in. Three minutes starts now. Jen's just gonna do a dance for several minutes. Yeah, yeah you, I mean, I cooked mine on the stove, so like, I, I don't know. There was a lot of dramatics, like the fire alarm went off. There was a lot of theatrics with your cooking situation. Oh, are you saying that I'm dramatic? I'm saying, weren't you a theater major? Wow, that's <laughs> rude and I'm saying. <laughs> I'm Jen, I'm rude and accurate I with am... frequency. <laughs> Sure, yeah. it would be hard to grab titties if your hands were just two oven mitts, you know? It's hard to grab titties when your hands are mitties. <laughs> Jen, I feel like your steak's gonna turn out better than mine by virtue of the fact that you got to cook your second. It's possible. 
<laughs> it's certainly possible. And some would say, is that fair? I would say yes. Time to flip. Okay. Oh, you're flipping her? Oh, bitch. Oh, <laughs> Flip her fast, flip her fast, flip her fast. We're gonna set off the alarm. I can't see. <laughs> you're gonna set off the alarm again. Okay. <laughs> so much oven smoke. Just. See? Go no. get the. <laughs> Alright, Kristen's gotta do this part. Well, then hold this. Every time. Sh shut up. No one asked you. We are silencing your voice. You say another word. I will find your mom and I will tell her that you are not allowed to come over. Go. Oh, that's not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> are you okay? Did you burn yourself? <gasps> I'm okay. Did you, what happened? The smoke got in my eyes. All right, we're gonna do an extra 30 seconds. And steak's done! Alright! Guess where we are? Ooh. My apartment. You are! Look at this light, actually. This yeah, is quite bad. Alright, we're ready. We're ready to we're judge. Because Kristen's gonna judge the steak first, and our judge today... This is Jen's roommate, Abigail! Yay! Thank you, for Thank you for judging the mystery steak -ums. I'm bringing you mystery steak -um one. Okay. That you will judge. Are you ready? I'm to ready. Try it? I'm so ready. So take a bite. Don't say anything. You're gonna tell us your thoughts later. Okay. Got it. She is really straight face. Oh my gosh. Are you ready for steak number two? I'm ready. All right, Abigail. Here is my steak. Thank you. I still got. Well, I was keeping it a mystery, but Jen gave up the ghost. Oh, whoops. Here's steak. <laughs> <laughs> Here's steak number two. <laughs> Don't be biased. So Abigail has tasted both of our steaks, both and now steaks. is time for a judgment. Okay. What did you think of my beautiful steak? What did you think of steak number one? Steak number one. Okay, so I really like this one, um, especially because I like really salty stuff, and this is salty. I love salt. Yeah, this seemed like a really good steak, like restaurant kind of steak. Ooh. Thank you. What did you think of steak number two? What did you think of steak <laughs> number two? That's Jen's steak. -ums. Okay, this steak was also really good. Jen's like a garlic girl, so I yeah. knew like mm -hmm. even if you had given this to me blindly, I knew this was gonna be Jen's because it oh, was you, you heavy on the garlic. You didn't taste the garlic on mine. I did, but not as I, much. I, oh, Clearly man. not as much. I don't like being the judge. I'm gonna hurt your feelings. You're not gonna hurt us at all. We're, we're just doing bits. We love Abigail. You guys will hurt our feelings if you comment on how weird the camera work is at my house. <laughs> that will hurt the feelings, okay, commenters? This camera work is awesome. It's really good. Actually, this light is beautiful. Yeah. My tits are great. If you had to pick a winning steak. Who's the winning steak? Steak number, number one or steak, steak number two? two? I think the winner here is Kristen. <gasps> I, know, I know. That's actually a shocker. Really? Yeah, well, so here's the thing is that Jen had like, Jen did a meticulous rub yeah. and marinade. And I was just like, honestly, let's just let the meat do its thing. Yeah, what the hell? Let's let the meat <laughs> okay. <laughs> I mean, but so the, but my steak was good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It was good. I just I today was, I just want salt. I mean, the steak kind of carried me. A bit. <laughs> yeah. I did not know what I was doing, and I set off the fire alarm twice. <laughs> Thank you to Butcher Box for sponsoring this video. Thank you to Abigail for coming and testing. Abigail. And thank you to Kristen's steak for I guess winning. <laughs> oh my god, my what? mine's really good. Thanks, guys. What should we fight about next? <laughs> Sorry, Thanks everybody. I'm busy. Kristen's got it. We got we're gonna eat steak. Bye. I love you. Thank oh. you, Butcher Box. Yeah.